So today is Hawkeye's birthday and I've been like planning a surprise party for probably like a year. Well, not really a surprise party because you're, like, you're not going to have anybody over obviously because of COVID. But I was going to try to make a party even though he doesn't like parties and he's always like, yeah, like we don't have parties in China so like why would you do it? I don't care about surprise. So I didn't get him a present or anything because um, I know that he's picky about kind of like like if I was gonna like go like hey I want to buy you a pair of shoes it'd be better just to take him to buy a pair of shoes because he's so really 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 picky he has like um uh he has like not normal feet so like I have one foot that's flat footed but he has high arches so if some shoes like be even though they fit it hurts here also my hands really dry don't ignore that <laughs> sorry I bought scallops and crabs. I'm gonna steam crab legs, make a dipping sauce, maybe two different dipping sauces. And then for an appetizer, I'm going to sear scallops with a basil lemon like sauce with it. I don't know, I'm trying to come up with stuff. Um, so that's gonna be interesting. And then for dessert, I bought like a raspberry tart because he doesn't really like sweets like normal people, like normal cake, he would prefer like, like fruit. So I thought a fruit tart would be probably the best choice. And I got him a birthday candle. <laughs> Not one with his age, because I would just be ridiculous. <laughs> but um, I bought him flowers, but his favorite color. So his favorite colors, he'll always say it's blue. Sometimes he says red, because he knows my favorite color is red. But in all reality, he really likes yellow and orange. But he never says it's his favorite color. It's really weird, I don't know. But anyway, these are the flowers. They're roses, but they're yellow, and they're really pretty. I got these from Fry's for only $10 for this many. And we are going to just cut them down and see what we want to do with this. I have this vase that he bought from Goodwill, so it still has a sticker on it, and it but it's big enough, so. And here we are. <laughs> Beautiful. And I'm just going to add this ribbon. All right. Final product. Perfect. The flowers are done. All right. I have found the balloons. Now it is only fair that we blow up as many as we can. I will blow up a few, and then when we come back, I'll show you guys my progress after how much time it takes. So I don't have to sit here in silence and I can play music while I do it or watch a video. I should have gotten one of those hand pumpers. Maybe I should go to Party City. Dollar Store or Party City? Dollar Store or Party City? Probably Party City because it's a Friday and Dollar Store is very bad at service. <laughs> at least the one by me. Ah, how much bigger should I get? I'm like pushing with all my force, my diaphragm. big, don't you think? Okay, I'm really good at tying these. I never have a problem tying balloons. It's just blowing them up. But. Okay, that's a pretty big balloon. Okay, throwing it behind me. <laughs> Dude, I'm so thirsty. What I feel like okay um we'll be back after I blow up however many balloons this is I actually don't know this could be I don't know we're gonna blow up as many as we want and then after that I'm gonna go to party city and actually I'll probably end up going to party city for balloons and also to get a hand pumper and then I'll be back yeah so see ya bye <laughs> all right I'm back from the store. I bought, I wanted to buy a cat balloon. They had like this huge cat that says happy birthday. And then they were out of them and I was really sad. But I bought this one because it's gold and it says happy birthday. 
But it comes with all these freaking streamers attached to it, so I don't know if I'm going to take them off, but maybe I'll just leave them for now. It's kind of ugly looking with the streamers, but it has a little thing to keep on the ground, to keep it floating. The streamers keep breaking off because they got ripped up in the car on accident. But anyway, that's, that's the... That's the balloon. <laughs> and because I have like a problem where if I see like an ad for something, I have to buy it even if I don't like it or like the person. But I wanted to try the Charlie drink because I didn't even know that Dunkin' had cold cream because like obviously other places do like Dunkin' Donuts has, or not Dunkin' Donuts, I'm stupid. I didn't know Dunkin' Donuts had cold cream. Dutch Bros does, if you guys know what it is. It's a thing on the West Coast. If you don't have it, you don't have it. <laughs> um, Starbucks has it, obviously. So I was like, cold brew with cold cream with cinnamon sugar sprinkles. I like cinnamon sprinkles at like the um, at Dutch Bros. So I was like, oh, I'll just try it, even though I don't really, I don't hate Charlie, but like I feel like what she does is kind of stupid. Like if you think about it, like how many people follow someone when they're literally just like this? Like this is what it looks like to me most of the time. I'm not a dancer, so don't be offended, okay? But from dancers, a lot of people say she has like, that's not really like dancing. Like, and I know dancers. I work with moms that have dancers, real dancers. So basically all of them just look like this to me, like. <laughs> like that's literally what it looks like to me, but what do I know? Anyway, we went to Party City. I got a hand pump. Oh, I didn't buy strings because I don't see the reason to put like, like why would you put, yeah. Anyway, and then I found these really cool things. They kind of reminded me of like Chinese lanterns. I thought Hawkeye would like them. So we're gonna figure out these and hang these up with like tape or something on the wall or I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna do something. And then because I didn't give him a birthday present because like like I said, like I'd rather just have Haokai go to a store with me to pick something out because technically, not to, I'm not even embarrassed, okay? Technically, I don't make any money. I don't make any money. He makes all the money. Um, it's not by my choice. Like I would totally go and get a job, but he would rather me not work and rather me just like focus on like Dobian and, and like YouTube. Although I haven't been the best on YouTube and I totally see people commenting like, why are you posting gaming videos? I initially wanted to be a gaming channel since I was literally like 12 years old. Obviously I have two different types of fans on my channel. I actually started with gaming videos. A lot of you probably don't realize. Um, but I, I hear what people are saying like, yes, I'm going to start making regular videos and I'm making a Twitch account for my gaming and another YouTube channel for gaming. So if you are interested in that, you can subscribe when I make my channel because I'm waiting on the art. <laughs> but yeah, I hear you guys. So I'm going to start making more videos on my own. It's just I always intended this channel to be like a couple's channel where how can I would be involved. But then he's like always at work and his life is really stressful right now because he almost graduated his PhD. And hopefully like by May he has it, but it's a mess. So <laughs> that being said, he has all the money, so there was be no reason for me to go and spend the money in my account that's originally his, buy him a present that he may not fit, like for example, like maybe a shirt, which is what I was intending to buy him, like a piece of clothing, because he doesn't own a lot of clothes, like most of his clothes are like from when he first came here five years ago. So from that perspective, I would rather uh, take him to the store with money. My grandma um, sent him birthday money, so... <laughs> Uh, she actually remembered his birthday. I was surprised because my mom actually forgot. I call, she called me today and I was like, oh, do you know what today is? And she's like, what? And I'm like, how guy's birthday? And she goes, oh no, I better tell him happy birthday. It was in the morning though, so not a big deal. But yeah, my grandma sent him money because she thinks of him as like her, like a grandson, you know, not just like, oh, married to her granddaughter, which is really sweet. And so how is probably going to use that to buy maybe some new shirts for work he needs some new ones or some shoes because he likes shoes <laughs> um so that's when i probably would go to the store with him i'm saying um a lot but i would probably go to the store with him and help him pick out something how guys uh for people that are asian out here that live in america you probably have the same problem if you're an asian male in america the clothes here are man meant for men that are like much longer torso and i'm not saying all asians have short torsos but my husband does and my husband doesn't really, his shoulders are different, like, they're not, like, broad, but they're not, like, mine where they're non-existent. 
but he because my husband like he builds more muscle in his back and his shoulders so he's really big there so a lot of shirts that are like made for like the average american and i'm not saying a race thing because it could literally be any race so for anyone to come after me and be like what american do you mean white people no like in general the average american build which is what fashion is made for like the average average skinny guy regardless of race um would be like this longer torso button-up shirt with like wide shoulders and i even find that with female shirts they're usually wide in the shoulders and i have no shoulders so they not work for me anyway so from that being said, I can't pick him out shirts because he can't fit any of them. And actually, in fact, he, most of his clothes are European or Japanese because literally nothing fits. <laughs> and Japanese because if you know uh, Unico, they have really good brands. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys what I got. Then I got, then we got this birthday cat card, which says birthdays are like cats. And then you open it up and there's like all these cats in here. <laughs> And it says, the more you have, the more likely your house will smell funny. Hope it's meowvelous. And the only reason I got this is not because we have cats, but because Hakka used to have a cat, and he's always loved cats. So I thought that would be a cute little thing to get him. Let's put that somewhere safe. And now, time to blow balloons and try out the hand pump. And hopefully it's easier than what I was using earlier, because that thing, using my mouth, that thing, I referred to myself as a you get what I mean. <laughs> okay, it has this weird, I don't even know how this works. Balloon pump. It's in Spanish, I don't know what that means. Dude, there's still directions? Am I supposed to just figure this out? Let's see. Um, let's see the scientist in me figure this out, okay? Because the bottom, I don't know how, to... dude, what the hell? Bro, can someone tell me if I'm doing this? <laughs> Ay -ya. Bro, what the heck is this? Is it supposed to go from... I don't know... Ugh. Does it go from like this? Or is this supposed to stay on and then you're supposed to just go like this? Bro. Why does this, this doesn't even say how to use it. Oh my gosh. It's already breaking on me. Dude, I don't know how to use this. I feel stupid. Um, I thought this would be easier. Okay, well, we're just gonna try and see if this actually works and if not. Dude, what the heck is this? Dude, <laughs> look at this. <laughs> what the heck is this? What am I supposed to do with this? I don't understand. Know, where's the balloon, people? That worked. That's not that bad. Maybe it's just to start them. Maybe it wasn't intended for people like me. <laughs> it's like it's like Party City. Why are you selling a balloon that you bought from like or a balloon pump from like Mexico, but then you like leave all the all of the words that are in Spanish and there's no directions? Like, don't they realize people like me are kind of dumb? We will be back. We'll be back with this program shortly. Yes. So, we made balloons. I mean, to my husband, I know. People are gonna be like, okay. Well, I'll come back when Hawkeye's actually here because I can't cook this till he's actually here. So, Hawkeye came home while I was cooking. I didn't film because when I'm cooking, it's too hard to film and do it. So, I made scallops with a basil pesto thingy with clarified butter mm. that I made. It looked beautiful. Yeah. Are you gonna try it? Yeah, I'm gonna try it. I've never had this before. This is the appetizer. It's not the oh my gosh, that's not how you eat it. How do you eat it? Ah, uh, I messed up. <laughs> Usually I have a knife, but I'm too lazy to use one. Mmm. Mmm. I love it. Hmm. 
perfectly cooked. How do you make the sauce? Clarified butter. Mm hmm Lemon juice and basil. Yeah. Perfectly cooked. Mmm. Honestly, scallops could still be a little raw and I would still eat them. I, mean, I, I don't like them overcooked, but mm -hmm. it's just seafood. You can eat raw seafood and nothing will happen. Yeah. Can I have some coffee? Why? I'm thirsty. Water. The better for you. Okay, thank you. Alright, save your mm -hmm. fork for yep. dipping. Save yep. your fork. Save your fork, sir. Jeez. I'm trying to be your server. We got crab legs and clarified butter oh. for dinner. And then after that, we have a dessert. Oh, really? Because no birthday mm. is a birthday without cake. <laughs> Don't worry, a small one. Okay. And I didn't buy like a normal cake because you were like, mm. I don't really like cake. It's too sweet. So True. I bought you something that should fit in with your taste buds. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, it's hot. Yeah. Thank you, baby. So fresh. Oh. Oh. What? I broke it. Mmm. The butter is good. It's spicy, though. I yep. put cayenne in it. Because I like a little kick. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. It's good. Mm. Mm. I'll take a little slice because I'm not like how can I, I can't bite through crab and not break my teeth. Mm -hmm. This is good. Mm. <laughs> Happy birthday. You're not supposed to sing it. Well, it's, I'm reading it. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hawkeye. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Yes. Well, you're not like me. What? Every, okay, I'll explain. Every year, and don't know if every country does this, but... In my family, everybody used to joke that if you don't blow all your candles out, that however many candles are still lit is how many guys you'll have before marriage, uh -huh. like date or whatever. Mm -hmm. So my family used to bully me because I would be the one person that would have like 20 candles and I'd only blow up like, blow out 10. Mm. It's very depressing. Yeah. But. It's funny. What is it? It's a tart. Oh. Raspberry fruit tart. tart. Yeah. I figured you would like fruit better than anything yeah. else. Yes. I only took 14 minutes to get there. Mm -hmm. And I didn't even go on the freeway. Oh. Because it's too busy. Mm -hmm. mm. I said there was a two minute delay. It's good. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Probably wouldn't be my first choice. I'm not really a fruit person. But I yeah. would rather eat vegetables than fruits. I know most people are the opposite, but like I wouldn't eat this like all the time. But it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You mean vegetables on a cake? No, but I mean like... General. In general, fruit tarts mm. are not my thing. Mm -hmm. But I figure if I'm picking something for my husband, mm. so no, I, it probably would be best to mm -hmm. buy him something like this. Yeah, when I was a kid, all the ice cream I, I ate, That's custard. all flavored, uh, fruit flavor. Mm. Mm. 
That has real fruit though. Yeah. On the top. Mm. Real raspberries. Yeah. And it's small. Mm -hmm. I thought, you know, Hawkeye doesn't really like sweets, mm. but this is just a tiny cake. So yeah. I figured out of all the choices I can make mm. for my husband, mm. a fruit tart would probably fit in well with him. Yeah, I like it. It's the best cake. It's not very sweet. Mm -mm. Mm. I can't eat all of it. That's because it's a tart berry. Mm -hmm. I'm going to eat more. Why, wow, you like it? Yeah. Mm. I actually was unsure if I would like it, but I actually like it. Mm. It's kind of funny, I don't usually like raspberries. Yeah. Remember last time you uh, left for me. The cake from Safeway? Mm. But you didn't eat it. Oh yeah. I forgot. Mm -hmm. But I don't want it to go bad. Mm. It wasn't the best. I don't think I'm a big cheesecake fan anymore. Mm. I used to love cheesecake, but when I had theirs, mm. it didn't hit the same. Mm. Maybe that's a sign that I'm growing up. <laughs> My, uh, They say like every seven years your taste buds change. So like you might hate something for like years. And suddenly mm. like it. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know if anyone can explain this, but when I was a kid, mm. anytime I would eat chocolate cake, I would get a horrible stomach cake. Oh. I would feel like I was, like, in pain. Yeah. Like, allergic reaction. Mm -hmm. But then, now it doesn't happen. Very confusing. Very, very confusing. You didn't have the enzyme. What enzyme? Enzyme for chocolate. Mm -hmm. Look at my plate compared to your plate. Yeah. What's the difference? Mine is a mess. Alright, well bye. Hawkeye is going to hang out with me now because we can't film every bit of our life. And then I'll edit this video at some point. Probably tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I'm tired from running around. Mm -hmm. Getting everything ready. Yeah. Kiss. Wait, wait, wait I have something for you. Oh. I almost forgot. I'm gonna light you on fire, that's what I'm gonna do, that's okay. What's this? A card. Oh, my hands are dirty, it's fine. It's fine. Can't open it. Just rip it, jeez. Do you see your name on there? What does it say? Okay, and the, there's a heart. Oh, yeah, yeah, they already saw. Oh, oh okay. Da, da, da. Oh, this is from Target. No, it's from Party City. Oh, oh cats! Birthday are like cats. Birthdays are like cats. Mm -hmm. Oh, look! What does it say? The more you have, the more likely it is your house will smell funny. Do you see what I drew on the card? Oh, I see. Hope it's Mjölverslers, Mjölverslers, Mjölverslers. Mhm. Mhm. Question mark. That cat mm. looks confused. Yeah. Mm. This cat's flying in the air. Mm. Yeah. Mm. This cat is uh, like kung fu. panicked. My cat's doing kung fu. Mhm. Mm I love it. I'm going to put it here. Oh,